The gospel is the greatest news in the world. We know that. God sent His only begotten Son, Jesus, to live the life we could not live, to die the death we deserve to die, and to conquer the enemy we could not conquer. So anyone, anywhere, who turns to our Lord Jesus Christ and trusts Him as Savior and Lord, will be forgiven of their sin and restored to relationship with God for all eternity. Now, <clears throat> karon kay mga magtutuo naman ta, we are believers in Christ. We should uh, take note the seven uh, things that Christians should tell themselves every day. Atong I kadang pahinom doms tung ko galingon nga ang Dios atong amahan. God is my Father and Christ is my Savior. Heaven is my home and Scripture is my guide. Every believer is my family. The Gospel is my message and God's glory is my goal. It's my purpose. <clears throat> again, so again. Uh, again. Again, again. Again, the seven again. things Christians should tell themselves. Okay. There are seven things. Kung naga take note ka, seven things Christians should tell themselves every day. Every day. Number one, God is my Father. Number two, Christ is my Savior. Number three, heaven is my home. Number four, scripture is my guide. Number five, every believer is my family. Number six, the gospel is my message. And number seven, God's glory is my goal. Kuha ni mo, Che? Kuha, Che. Kuha tito. Thank you. Okay. Now remember, as we evangelize people, witness them for Christ, we should always remember that there are two kinds of gospel, true gospel and false gospel. Okay, habini mo, the true gospel usually begins, uh, ang true gospel, uh, usually begins, it does not begin with God loving you and His wonderful plan for your life. Dili. Dili ni maoy sinugdanan. It begins, pabina, it begins with you have nothing. You are nothing. And you can do nothing. That is where the gospel begins. Dili tong wingon nga ang Dios na gigugma kanimo na has wonderful plan for your life. No. Akumalikon, it begins with you have nothing. You are nothing. And you can do nothing. That is where the gospel begins. Kay this is the total opposite of the prosperity gospel, which is no gospel at all. Di man nina, di ligyod gospel ka ng ilang pagsangyaw, no hay. It's no gospel at all. And there is a reason why, di ha sa libro ni Isaiah, Isaiah, recording of this, he starts with those who are poor. Mogi yung sugdon ang mga kabus because you never are going to come to God until until you know you are nothing and you have nothing and you can do nothing because makasasahal ka you are a sinner totally helpless to save yourself mo naingan lang total depravity Wow, gitay mahimos tong kaugalingon pagluwas sa tong kaugalingon. 
Ang kaya nga lang may yung, ah, magbuhat din kung maayo. Ah, ni Ana, magbuhat o maayo. Now, doon na raba po iduha kaklaseng maayo. There are two kinds of good works. Now, I'm talking about good works. Na ay human good works o na po ay divine good works. Unsa man eh. Karun pagkakadungog tinga linin eh. Kaya wala man eh, di li man eh. Sangyaw sa iwan li sa mga kasimbahan lang di. Di ka kadungog ni ni. There are two kinds of good works. Divine, ngaya sa Diyos, o tawhanon. Nga maayong buhat. Okay, unsa man eh mga maayong buhat nga tawhanon. Human. Okay. By the way, kining human good, ha? Kada bang pagbuhat ni mo, kadang, ah, pag, ah, kadang, hinuta mo hatag ka o mga, ah, agikaluoy sa mga pobre, pubisita sa mga napriso, kung saan niya, good works man na, di ba? Before the eyes of God, good works na. Ang pandili na niya madawat, kaya di man nagika niya. Di ka man nasa tao, Through the energy niya, through his energy, he's doing it, not as unto the Lord, but as unto him. That's why the ego na siya sa mga tao, believe ko lang tawa na, mga ayong tao yun. Sige lang yun na siya, donate, he is a philanthropist, all of that. Mga ayong tao yun. Giday siya sa kalibutan. Kaya katong yung pagbuhan niya doon is through the energy of his flesh. Believe ang tao, but dili believe ang Diyos. <laughs> God does not accept His good works. Imo man ang gibuhat sa imong unod. Di na na ako madawat. That is human good. Kanang iyang gibuhat ng mayo, ng tawanon, is compared to kogon, akana, kogon, kahoy, o dagami. Now, Bukutan na ko nimo. Duslite ko noon ng kahoy, kogon, ug dagami. Masunog ba na? Sunog kayo. Sila um gina. Hantod maugdaw gina. Na I hope makasabot mo nina akong binisaya. Ugdaw. Ha? Kine, diya sa isiya po, hindi yung unog filthy rags. Baho, matrapo sa tubangan sa Diyos. So, di li magkalawat ang Diyos niya na. Ha? Bantay, ha? Bantay yun ang kining punto, ha? Human good. Ang definition ng Diyos, human good, is anything and everything a believer does outside of the plan of God is human good. Did you understand what I'm explaining? Nasabtan ba ninyo? Yes, ito. Yes, ito. Okay. Uh, tubag po mo, ha? Mungutan yes. na ako ninyo. Okay, nasabtan ninyo, ha? Human good. And to tas divine good. Unsa man yung divine good? Buhat ni as unto the Lord. Mga mayong buhat. Hmm. Parihal ko na itong gibuhat sa itong believer who is doing the human good. Para apanangi mo, gibasi ni mo ang pulong sa Diyos based on the Word of God, and uh, kind of, you do it as unto the Lord. Kine gitandi ni sa uh, kind of silver, gold, precious stones. Now, mungutan na ko ni mo, dusliti ko nuna, kind of silver, gold, or precious stones. Masunog ba na? Di raba na masunog. Because they are non-combustible. Whereas ang human God is combustible, masunog. So, kana ray mulungtad, well, unsa? Kada, mugawas giyon nga, uh, kada, mulungtad ba? Okay. Well, last. Therefore, maura na matang sa God nga rewardable during the judgment seat of Christ. Mauna. Make sure that they're in fellowship. Okay, niya pa yung saka punto nga kung nadunin mo. While you do it, ha, kanang pagbuhat ni mo sa 
divine good. Be sure that you are inside the protocol plan of God or inside the operational divine dinosphere. Unsa man, unsa man paagiha nga nakakas divine dinosphere nga ikaw mo gamit sa rebound so you can be cleansed of your sins as assured by 1st John 1 9 na nagingon nga if we confess our sins, God is faithful and just to forgive us our sins and to cleanse us from all unrighteousness. Therefore, once you rebound, Mugamit ka sa 1 John 1 9 principle, you are clear of any sin. One na kay unconfessed sin. Therefore, you are in a state of unsa? Spirituality. Now, there are kanang. <coughs> opposite ning kaning spirituality o carnality. Once you have sins that you are, you have not named to God, you are in a state of sin o unsa, carnal ka. Mga naigisulti sa pulong sa Dios. God's word says, you are carnal. Your status is carnal. O kay carnal ka man, gi-compare ka gi-kanang Again, ang analogy nini is the prodigal son. 